Corona Watch, episode eight. Happy St. Patrick's Day. It's only fitting to wear my Guinness sweatshirt, even though Italy never gives a hoot or a holler about St. Patrick's Day, and apparently neither does England, but we won't talk about that. About to venture into the outside world of which I have not seen in many moons, but I don't have a mask yet, but I do recall the little dude next door selling them for 10 euro, so. Food safe gloves, which I have in my pocket, and uh, I'm gonna try and remember to take photos and videos and stuff before I put them on and start touching stuff. Because last time I went out, there was way more people than I expected to see outside. So let's see how seriously everyone's actually taking this. And if my little market's open. Okay, bye. <laughs> Thank you for being a friend. Travel down the road and back again. Your heart is true. You're a pal and a confidant. And if you threw a party, invited everyone you knew, you would see the biggest gift would be from me. And the card attached would say, thank you for being a friend. Corona Watch 2020, episode nine. Everyone's feeling well this post uh, St. Patrick's Day. I know no one got too turned up, so that's good for your liver. And the internet has truly been a gem today. There's a lot of really wonderful things that I'm seeing that are giving me life and hope. For instance, if you haven't seen Sarah Palin on The Masked Singer singing, I like big butts and I cannot lie, that is a real thing. I also came across a great pickup line for these quarantine times and it's, you can't spell quarantine without U-R-A-Q-T. <laughs> So today is deep clean day, spring cleaning part two, to get ready for all of my non-existent guests that may or may not be coming at the end of this quarantine. I also plan on blasting Disney movies all day to uh, inspire my inner Cinderella. So if I happen to catch that on video, I'll be sure to share it. <laughs> Oh hey, it's Corona Watch 2020, episode 10, double digits, baby. Put some sparklers in my hair to uh, keep it festive. Trying to find the celebration in, in the little things, as it were. So, great news. Uh, looks like our lockdown is going to be extended and harsher rules imposed. I guess means we're going to be having a ban on all outdoor activities, including exercise. So um, it's time to get real comfortable. This was just announced a couple hours ago and of course nothing has really been detailed. So it's gonna be a wild ride next couple days. Also, does anyone else find it weird how different I look from this side than this side? Oh, there's a lot going on here. Also, I can't really tell if I'm actually getting fatter or if my rock hard abs are just starting to poke through the layer of fat. So more on that as it comes. So yeah, that's what I've got for you today. Um, please let me know if you have anything else you'd like to share or if you have uh, any queries that I may help with. Um, so this is just for next time. Oh. <laughs> update from the U.S. State Department for all Americans abroad, um, which basically says, uh, come home now or seek refuge where you are out of the country. 
obviously this is a weird time and this is a very um, hefty thing to process and something that requires a lot of thought, I think for all of uh, us expats. Um, but as my life and my home and my Benjamin are here, um, I will be in Rome, keeping you updated, keeping it fresh and hard hitting. And uh, hopefully this all relaxes. Just need, just need time, that's all we can do is just week by week it. Sending all of you lots and lots of love and I hope my, my weirdness is uh, keeping it fun and positive for you. But I just wanted to send that little update because it felt pertinent. So yeah. Yeah, you know what time it is. It's Corona Watch 2020, episode 11. Not gonna lie to y'all, it has been a rough 24 hours for the old Blaine Brown. Not every day is gonna be a winner, and that's okay. Had to do a lot of self-care this morning. I <laughs> uh, did a lot of yin yoga versus uh, the full Pilates challenge. That's okay, because I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. Well, in a certain way, it's been a very productive morning. Um, I hope you are all having wonderful, productive mornings um, in whatever state you might be in now, but no matter where you are, I hope you are staying inside. That's right, I am going to berate you and I am going to uh, be your mother in this. And don't forget to call your mother while we're at it. <laughs> yeah, so I'm turning my phone off for today. Um, of course, with the exception of the fabulous Blenji show, which will be starting at 8 p.m. Italian time. Also, does anyone know of any foods that are rich of vitamin D since I'm obviously never gonna see the sun again? Call now. Hey guys, thanks for tuning into our live show. Happy to have you. Apparently it cut off, uh, so you guys didn't hear Janice, which is now the second time we've done that. So, <laughs> we can work on being better with technology. And until then, um, happy butterflies, and uh, stay in, stay safe, and be good. Bye. Bye. I still get nervous every time you're around the corner. I still get angry every time my phone decides to call you. I still get hungry for your touch upon my shoulder. I still get Corona Watch 2020 episode 12. I'm losing my mind. <laughs> Honestly, though, things are going just great over here. Um... Uh, I got dressed today. <laughs> I truly have like the biggest hankering for a burger. So I'm going to leave to get some items to make that happen uh, because I feel like it's the only thing that's gonna keep me grounded. Could have had a ground beef uh, joke in there, missed the opportunity. I got my form all filled out to say where I'm going and why I'm going. I just hope they accept it in PDF uh, mobile form because I haven't had a printer since 1999 with this riveting news story as more develops and I hope to see you all later on the gram. Cause you're not looking for nice girls. You're not looking for nice girls. Hey, I'm back. Another two and a half hour market experience. What, what? Is this the new clubbing? I'm finally going to start making my burgers. I am roasting a red pepper. Uh, gonna get some smoked uh, scaramorza cheese. It's gonna be divine. What else? I'm gonna start day drinking. Because this is the world we live in now. There are no rules. Because you're not looking for nice girls. Episode 13. Lucky number 13. Not gonna be too funny this morning. I'm actually pissed. I think I'm going through all of the stages of grief and I'm at anger now. Um, this is also pre-yoga Blaine, so that's why we do this. So we had the highest death toll uh, to date in any part of the world yesterday here in Italy. Um, and we've been on lockdown for 13 days. North, which has been the hardest hit, has been on lockdown, I think six days more than that. So almost three weeks now. If you aren't taking this seriously, it's time to. 
It's infuriating how people are flying en masse to Hawaii because apparently this is vacation time when instead they're going to infect an entire isolated population. It's infuriating to see people socializing, um, having friends over, oh, but it, you know, none of us have symptoms, so it's fine. I think you're missing the point. It's infuriating that the only aid that Italy has received is from China. I thought this was the purpose of the EU, is to unify. Um, where is the EU now? Don't even get me started on Trump and uh, how Mr. Science Mike Pence is handling everything. Um, I'm speechless. Excuse my anger this morning. Um, I know a lot of you come here to see me be funny, um, which I, I'll get back to, I'm sure. I just have a request. Every single person watching me put something up on their story or on Facebook or texting or calling or homing pigeon or whatever it is you want to do. It's time to make everyone understand, your friends, your family, your hate followers, that it is time to stay home and stop playing around. Okay, I'm gonna go flow it out. Thanks for letting me rant. Um, and I hope you have a great Sunday. I love you guys. You know what time it is. It's Corona Watch 2020. Episode 14. Two weeks. It's a celebration. First of all, I want to thank Miss Tara Larson for uh, this amazing microphone. Totally forgot I had it. And then uh, I saw her posting with it. So here we are. <laughs> it also helps uh, with <laughs> the lip ring is still there. Good. Let's keep it simple. Hey. It's a weird day. It's windy. It's cold. It's kind of going back to winter mode. I know because I can't go outside, but you know, I can assume and I feel the chill inside um, my home, so it's a wind chill at least. I'm being uh, mildly productive today, finally. Uh, I'm going through my hundreds of thousands of photos and labeling and deleting and stuff, so that's a fun activity you can do too. Still pissed that Malibu and Santa Monica had to close their parking lots down so people would stop going to the pier, but you know, that rant was for yesterday. <laughs> yeah, just uh, living my best life over here. What are you guys doing today? Have you thought of any uh, cool new activities that I should be doing? I only want to love you every morning, every night. I only want for you to want me with the same fire. I only dream of you and I together if only for a while. I just wanted to have some sex to make me come alive. But you're not looking for nice girls. You're not looking for nice girls. No, I, you're not looking for nice